Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. Today I just wanted to sit down with you guys and give you a little introduction into me, bring you guys into my life a little bit, and give you guys a more well-rounded idea of who you're subscribed to here on YouTube. And I am just so excited. If you hear my little guy, he is right here in my lap. My toddler, he's asleep. So I'm taking advantage while I have a few minutes. But I just wanted to give you guys a little bit of information, tell you a little bit about me and my family and some things that I'm passionate about. Kind of, I guess, also what you can expect to see on my channel. Something I am so excited about with this YouTube channel is just connecting and finding community with more like-minded people. Life seems to be getting lonelier and people feel like that they don't have anybody in their corner and I just want to foster a community where there is just so much positivity and it's an uplifting community for people to go to if you feel like you don't have anybody or if you're feeling lonely in a season of life. I know personally I'm a homemaker and a stay-at-home mom. It can just feel really lonely sometimes and be really challenging to put yourself out there and to find community but I have seen it personally and reaching out, trying to find your people, it has always benefited and blessed our family. I just want to create a community here where people are able to connect and do that as well. Another thing I want to achieve with this YouTube channel is just being a friend if you need a friend, if you need somebody to hang out with throughout your day, for my fellow homemakers and stay-at-home mamas especially. I love watching YouTube and home content and homemaking stuff and inspirational stuff when I'm at home, when I'm by myself with my kiddos, and it helps me feel like I have a friend in whoever is sharing. Even though it's just across this medium on YouTube, it has just been such a great way for me to find more enjoyment in being a stay-at-home mom and a homemaker, and it has also helped bring me closer to people that I never would have met if it wasn't for the internet and people putting out content. So I just hope that this channel can be a place where you can come. If you need a friend, I am here for you. And I am so excited to see where this YouTube channel goes. So without further ado, I'll tell you guys a little bit about me, about my family, some things I'm passionate about, which in turn is going to be the stuff I chat about on here because I don't believe in just sharing about one topic. I'm a full rounded person and I have so many different parts of me that I love to share. So many things I wanna try that I cannot wait to dive into. And I'm so excited to take you along on the journey with me. So I'll just hop right in. My name is Jordan and I'm 27 years old and I live here with my family in Pensacola, Florida. My family is my husband. He is in the Navy, which is what brought us here to Pensacola. We're both from Alaska. And so it has been quite the lifestyle change going from cold and beautiful Alaska to being here on the coast by the ocean, being able to go to the beach. It has just been the most amazing change in our life. And then we also are here with our two beautiful sons, Apollo, he's almost two. And then we have Artemis who was just born in December. So he's still our little guy and we hope to have a big family one day, but we're just taking it one kiddo at a time. And we're just excited to see how our family grows, if it's meant to over the course of the next, I don't know, however long. So we live here in Florida. My husband, he's my high school sweetheart as well. We've been together for 10 years, which is just uh, insane. We're a holistic wellness family. We really value prioritizing natural wellness above all else, doing what we can at home, home remedies, homeopathy, essential oils, supporting the body naturally. And with that comes prioritizing good nutrition as well, really focusing on nourishing and nutrient dense foods. And so we really value cooking from scratch at home. And that is one of my favorite parts of being a homemaker is cooking food for the people that I love. And that's something that I hope to dive into more here on my channel is cooking and sharing food content because food I feel like is the ultimate way to connect with people. And there is so much to be learned over a meal with people or just from pouring your love and your heart and your soul into your food for others to eat. And there's nothing like building community over food. And I truly believe that food is healing in so many ways. And I hope to bring that to the table here for you guys as well. But we also are a budget friendly family. We live on a budget and we try to live as frugally as possible. And we're also trying to minimize our stuff. When we moved down here from Alaska, 
we just had way too much stuff and it felt like we were trapped in our house. And we have slowly over the last year and a half since we've been here, really reduced the stuff in our home. So minimalism is playing more and more of a role in our lives at this point too, and just trying to keep things functional in our home. So you will see in the clips of our home, we are just very, very simple. We're just a very simple family. We don't have the perfect Pinterest decorated home. It is just so simple and we really love it that way. So I hope that can also inspire you to, if you are simple, if you are frugal, or if you are an aspiring minimalist like we are, or like I am, welcome friend. I am so happy you're here. A few other things that I'm super passionate about, canning, oh my gosh. I freaking love canning. It is one of my favorite hobbies I've ever learned how to do in my life. And it also helps us towards our goals of being more kind of self-sustaining, self-sufficient, I talked about community sufficiency in a couple videos ago, and I really believe in that. And in a way that we can do that for ourselves at home is by canning, preserving foods, and blessing others with kind of the fruits of our labor. So I love canning. A couple of my favorite projects that I've ever done, I have canned my own cranberry juice, which was to die for. It was amazing. And then my other favorite thing is pickled garlic. So good. So. That's one of my favorite hobbies. I'm hoping to get into sewing. That's kind of a hobby I want to challenge myself with this year. I'm just really trying to dive into these traditional skills and really challenge myself and see how much we can rely on ourselves and reduce the amount of outsourcing we have to do for our family. So with that said, some of our goals, I'll share with you guys some of our family goals. We live in base housing, which has been a total blessing for us. We are paying off debt. Like I said, we're we're a budget family and we're on a debt-free journey. We just have student loans left and then we will be able to look at purchasing some property and buying a home, which is just amazing. One of our huge goals is to be able to have animals that produce food for us through eggs and meat chickens. I would love to have a milk cow like years down the road. I'm nowhere near prepared for that, but that's a goal nonetheless. And then we also want to have a big, huge, flourishing, thriving garden not only with fruits and vegetables for us to eat, but also to bless our community members with, our family, our friends. And then I would love to have like a, a cut flower garden as well. So we just have flowers constantly. There's just no amount of joy that comes from anything like the joy that comes from some beautiful homegrown fresh cut flowers. So that's kind of our goals. That's a couple years down the road still. We don't know how much longer we're gonna be here in Florida. We have kind of a rough estimate, but it's a little bit up in the air right now. And so we know for sure while living here in Florida, we will continue living in our humble abode on base. And we will not be purchasing a home till we move next. And we'll see where the Navy takes us. So I just wanted to kind of introduce myself. Like I said, leave a comment down below, introduce yourself and find like-minded people to cultivate community with because people, we were not meant to do life alone, you guys. We were meant to have community. We're meant to have people in our corner. And I, if nothing else, just want this space to be a safe place for people to come and feel like they have somebody in their corner and a friend and somebody to spend their day with if you don't have somebody. So I will leave you guys with that. Make sure you subscribe before you leave because I have some content coming out that I'm really excited to be sharing with you guys. You saw that I got some starts. We're starting some seeds as well, and we're gonna be planting. We decided we're gonna plant in our front instead of just leaving it bare. And we're just so excited to go through the growing season. Even though it's about to be super blazing hot here in Florida, we're growing a lot of peppers, trying to experiment and learn to grow the skills that we're able to do before we have like a piece of property and animals to take care of one day. We wanna have those foundations laid and feel confident in what we're doing as well. So stick around. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you so much for being you. I can't wait to see you guys in the next one. Bye.